Newts are found in North America, North Africa, Europe, and Asia. While the Pacific Newts, Tericha, and the Eastern Newts, Notophthalmus, are the only representatives in North America, most diversity is found in the Old World, in Europe and the Middle East, the group's likely origin. Since newts share many of the characteristics of their salamander kin, caudata, including semi-permeable glandular skin, for equal-sized limbs, and a distinct tail, it is easy to understand why some people think these two distinct amphibians are the same animal. The reason why labels of newt and salamander are often used interchangeably. Essentially, all newts are salamanders, but not all salamanders are newts. The breeding season for newts, in the Northern Hemisphere, is in June and July. After courtship rituals of varying complexity, which take place in ponds or slow-moving streams, the male newt transfers a spermatophore, which is taken up by the female. Females deposit the eggs individually on leaves of aquatic plants, usually close to the surface. Using their hind legs they fold the leaf around the eggs to protect them from predators and radiation. It distinguishes them from the free-floating eggs of frogs or toads, which are laid in clumps or strings. Larvae are distinguished by their feathery external gills, and as in all salamanders and newts, forelimbs already present as stumps at hatching develop first, followed later by the back legs. After hatching in about three weeks, depending on temperature, they eat algae, small invertebrates, or other amphibian larvae. During the subsequent few months, the larvae undergo metamorphosis, developing legs, and the gills are absorbed and replaced by air-breathing lungs. Once fully metamorphosed, they leave the water and live a terrestrial life, when they are known as efts. Most species, after having reached adulthood, return to the water only to breed. During the land phase, prey includes earthworms and other annelids, insects, woodlice, and snails and slugs. During the breeding season, they prey on various aquatic invertebrates, and even tadpoles of other amphibians, such as the common frog and toad, and smaller newts. While many newts produce toxins from skin glands as a defense against predation, the toxins of the genus Tericha are particularly potent. An acrid smell radiates from the newt, which acts as a warning for animals to stay away. Although toxicity is generally experienced only if the newt is ingested, some individuals have been reported to experience skin irritation after dermal contact, particularly if the eyes are touched after handling the animal without washing hands. Newts produce a neurotoxin called tetrodotoxin TTX, the same toxin found in pufferfish and many other marine animals. Newts have the incredible ability to regenerate the main axis of the body and structures such as the eyes, tail, and limbs, lost in confrontations with other newts or an accident or escaping from predators. We hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget that each new subscriber and positive comment motivates us to create more and better content. Thanks for watching.